In this new video of Build Your Budget, we are going to go over the best $600 gaming PCs that you can buy right now, since this subscriber has requested me to do a video about it. As always, we are going to go from the cheapest to the most expensive one. Keep in mind that most of the PCs that will be shown in this video are for playing competitive games like Fortnite, Valorant, CSGO and Warzone. They are not optimal for high-end games, but you can always add a better graphics card in the future to play those high demanding games. However, if you are looking to buy a PC right now that can handle these type of games like Red Dead Redemption 2, I suggest you to watch my video about the Omen 30L that you have in the top right of the screen. Without more to say, let's just start. The first one, and also the cheapest one on the list, is from Newegg, the iPython Gaming Desktop. This one is around $430 and comes with an AMD Ryzen 3 32G with Vega 8 graphics. 8 gigs of RAM and 256GB of SSD. For the price that you pay, you get to play basic competitive games like Valorant and Fortnite at around 60fps on competitive settings at 1080p. And for high-end competitive games like Warzone or Apex Legends, you should expect frame rates between 35 to 40 FPS in low to medium settings at a resolution of 720p. The downside of this one is the RAM and storage, but you can up them later in order to increase performance. The next under $600 gaming PC on the list is the CUK Athrock Desk Mini X300W Tiny Desktop. This gaming PC is around $520 and is an upgraded version from the previous one since it has very similar components. It has a Ryzen 3 3200G, Big A graphics, but this time you get 16 gigs of RAM and 512 gigabytes of SSD. So, if you don't want to add the RAM and storage to the previous one by yourself, you should go for this one. For competitive games, you should expect a performance of 70 FPS average in simple competitive games at 1080p. And for Warzone and Apex Legends in 720p resolution, you can get around 40 to 50 FPS on average from low to medium settings. Another thing to keep in mind is that because of the 16 gigs of RAM, you can start streaming games like Minecraft or League of Legends and even editing some videos. So overall, not a bad choice if you have this type of budget. And the best $600 gaming PC on the list is the HP Pavilion TP01-2165. This one is on sale right now, so if you like these specifications, I recommend you to get it as soon as possible. The price is actually $650. Before you comment that it's over $600, let me tell you that for those $50 extra, you get one of the greatest deals I could find on the market right now. It features the AMD Ryzen 5 5600G with AMD integrated graphics Vega 7. This one has 16GB of RAM. 256GB of SSD and 2TB of hard drive. For the price that you pay while this PC is on sale, you get a really good gaming PC. You can play most of competitive games at above 60 FPS in medium to high settings with high demanding competitive games like Apex Legends. You can even start playing high demanding games like The Witcher 3 or Battlefield 5 at around 40 FPS on average. In my opinion, it's a way better choice than the previous PCs since it comes with a better processor much more space and a much better integrated graphics card. But it's not enough to start playing the newest high demanding games. If you have a budget up to $1000, I recommend you to watch my video about the best pre-built gaming PCs under $1000. And if you found this video helpful, please leave a like, subscribe, but most importantly hit the bell button so you don't miss any of my videos. Leave it in the comments and I will reply as fast as possible. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you on the next one.